Saints and uh, brothers and sisters, if anybody wants to bring Bart in, how could how could people get a hold of you to be able to come and maybe yeah. do these these days of equipping and the things yeah. that you're doing? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I'd love to, I'd love to come. Uh, you can go to JP Two Healing Center. That's JP Small I Small I Healing Center dot org. Okay. JP Two Healing Center dot org. Okay, and that'll be we'll put that on the screen so everybody can have it. Friends, friends. Yeah. Uh, again, thanks for coming. Yeah, thank you, Peter. Friends, I want to tell you about a new book that I wrote called Fear God and Give Him Glory. You know, the fear of the Lord is a wonderful, wonderful thing. It, it brings wisdom. It brings life and purity. And uh, there's so much that the church needs now to stand, to have the courage to move ahead. So in order to get this book, let, there's going to be information coming uh, in just a few minutes about where you can find it. Go to our website. It's all there for you. Until next week, this is Peter Herbeck saying, God bless you. Let's give our hearts to a loving Father. One of the most overlooked yet foundational spiritual gifts is the fear of the Lord. The scriptures call this gift a fountain of life, a source of confidence and the beginning of wisdom. Today, our culture, politics, and even the church are in crisis. Everyone can see the deep division, the escalation of anger and violence, and whole nations seem to be in the grip of fear. We have come to fear the wrong things, the opinions of men, and losing our idols. The fear of God is not in the land, and God in his mercy is shaking the nations to wake us up so we hear his word. Do not fear what this people fear. Rather, fear God and give him glory. In this booklet, I explain the fear of the Lord, why it is an antidote to the current crisis, and how you can awaken this gift in your life. To receive a free copy, visit our website or call the number on the screen.